What's good, y'all? I'm the Psychedelic Seal, back to bring you my sort of blind playthrough through Ocarina of Time. Last time we got to this here village in Kakariko, and now we gotta go right up to Death Mountain. Show this dude right here the letter from Princess Zelda. Oh, I am excited to get back to this. It's been a few days since I've been able to play this. Oh, this is... This is surely Princess Zelda's handwriting. Well, let's see. Hmm... Okay, this is Seal. He is under my orders to save Hyrule. <laughs> what kind of funny game has our princess come up with now? Okay, okay, all right. You can go now. Just be careful, Mr. Hero. <laughs> so many gatekeepers in this game, man. So many gatekeepers. By the way, Mr. Hero, if you're going to climb Death Mountain, you should equip a proper shield. It is an active volcano after- oh god. That's just super cash, just having a nice, quaint little village at the bottom of an active volcano. Should give you a special discount. If you think you're good to go already, don't worry about it. Okay, I think, yeah, we already have the shield from our time in the graveyard. So, let's get going. Have you been to the Happy Mass Shop? that just opened in Hyrule Castle Town Market. Everyone is talking about it. My little boy pesters me for a popular mask, but I don't have time to go there. I'm guarding this gate that's now open. So could you go and get the mask for me next time? If you don't feel like it, that's okay. But well, I have no choice. This is my job. All day, every day, I am at this gate. Well, let's go ahead and equip the shield though, especially since we have it. Especially see that, that real, okay, it's not quite as nice metallic, but I do love the bold colors on that shield. The blue with the red. And I love the ring of smoke. I don't think that that's something that happens naturally with volcanoes. I could be completely mistaken. It'd be really dope if it was. But let's go ahead and make our way next to these little spider crab looking things. Get away from me. All right, let's see. It's about to be nighttime already. Oh, piece of the heart. Oh, and we see our first Goron. Wake up. Speak to me. I'm interested to hear what you have to say. I am the one of the Gorons, the stone-eating people who live on Death Mountain. Look at that huge boulder over there. It blocks the entrance to the Dodongo's Cavern, which was once a very important place for us Gorons. But one day, Mindy Dodongo suddenly appeared inside... Dude, the cavern's name... The cavern's named after Dodongos. What did you think was going to happen? On top of that, the Gerudo in black armor used his magic to seal the entrance with that boulder. If you want to hear more Goron gossip, head on down to our city. Goron City is just a little way up the way trail. It won't take much long to get there, even on foot. Oh, God! Kind of hear the music kind of ramping up there for half a second before it got all nighttime and quiet. I always did like the effect of the, what do you have to say? Of the wolf signaling that, okay then. Have a good nap, my boy. Of the wolf signaling that it is like time to, you know, be nighttime. I've always liked that effect. It's a lot more subtle in the Wind Waker, but I think in this it works super well. Uh, we might as well just go right into the city. There's really no reason to hold on. We do have full money, so that was a little moot. But let's see. I don't remember Goron City hardly at all. Yo, this music, though. This music, though. Hello, sir. Oh, I'm so hungry. Everyone feels faint from hunger because of the food shortage in this town. We are in danger of extinction. It's all because we can't enter our quarry, the Dodongo's Cavern. We Gorons live on a diet of rocks. And the most delicious and nutritious rocks are found in the Dodongo's Cavern, but that seems like ancient history now. We've become such gourmets that we can't stand to eat rocks from anywhere else. Yo, that's like my dog growing up. It would like... Like, I know you're not supposed to give dogs table scraps, but we would always give them some table scraps. But he was picky about it. Like, if it was something he didn't want, he would just look at us like, Really? That's all you're going to give me? You're kind of wasting my time, my dude. Oh, I love that dog so damn much. All right. Uh, I mean, we might as well just keep exploring. I 
really don't have much of a... Oh, God. Wow, that was rude. I guess that is like when you're in like a mall or something and then you cut the corner and somebody just runs into you. Like, it's kind of your fault, but also kind of not. Uh, we can go down to the bottom. We don't have the means to get the bomb flowers yet. Ooh, that's a nice little... I don't want... What would Saria say if we're going to save Hyrule? Well, that's a nice little hint. I just want to see this little pixel art. This little cave pixel art. That's adorable. Goron's got some pot bellies though with some chicken legs. I will say that. Some cuckoo legs, perhaps? Ah, ah, ah. What's good, boy? I, I don't mean to slash these guys, I swear. Oh? We don't get many visitors way up here. Where are you from? The forest? What's a forest? Eh? It's where a lot of trees and plants grow? Now I'm even more confused. Nothing grows around here besides the bomb flowers. We don't have seeds or nuts around here either. Oh, poor guys. Even Deku sticks are very scarce around here. I know a trick to conserve sticks. If you light a stick on fire, it will burn to ashes. Press A to put it away. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I appreciate you. I hope you have the best nap afterwards. I hit a stick somewhere. Yikeroonies. Maybe... And maybe we gotta light all these torches. That really seems like the only thing that we can do at this point. Perhaps. Oh, there's a stick. Thank you for hiding the stick, my boy. SpongeBob, me boy. I don't know why everybody's my boy today. Uh, can I slash these? What about maybe? Because that's, I know that's the Lost Woods music. The Lost Woods music is freaking iconic. You can't miss it. So that means I really hope I don't have to travel all the way across Hyrule Field, especially since when you boot the game back up. I've never, I guess it's just the limitations within how the Nintendo 64 memory works. But since if you uh, boot back up the system after saving it and quitting, it boots you back to the beginning of Link's house. I think, if I remember correctly, it does the same in an adult section, but it just boots you back to the Temple of Time. And ain't no thing, Chicken Wang. I just want to be able to find... There's got to be some type of... Well, there's the... There's the shop. Okay, what do you have to say? Maybe you can give me a hint, because God knows I can't. Big Brother has shut himself up in his room, saying, I will wait here for the royal family's messenger. Well... What, what do this do? It looks like this doesn't... Alright. Big brother. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so... I guess you have to show it directly to him, but... I gotta find a torch so I can be able to light all these guys. And that Goron seems like that would be the move. I just don't know where the hell the torch is. Where's the torch? Aren't you all so glad that I edited these videos? <laughs> huh. Oh god. Do not pancake me, por favor. You've done it once already. Oh wait, I see fire? A fire of sorts. I mean, it would make sense if you could just dip this. I was about to say dip your stick down in it, but oh, I don't know about none of that. This music kind of puts like a haze behind my eyes, dude. All right, all right. Tight rope walking, look at him go. Tight rope walking, I'm here. Oh God, I almost fell off. Hey. It's dangerous for a little kid like you to come out here. You might fall down. If I'm not mistaken, you came out here to eat the red stone. Well, too bad, it's not here. What? That's not why you're here. You're looking for a spiritual stone? You must mean that delicious looking red stone that was once displayed here. I was so hungry that I thought it would be okay to just give it one tiny little lick. So I snuck out here, but it was already gone. I think Big Brother took it away. He always says that everyone is after that red stone. I don't know why. I don't know why it sounds like it should be on Long Long Ranch right now. I will wait in here for the role of family's messenger. Like my dude, I have. I'm obviously missing something. So obvious right now, because my limited Zelda experience tells me that this torch needs to be lit for that door to open. Or maybe check. You're standing on a soft carpet for guests. It feels so plush under your feet. Can I just like go right here? Nope. Uh, whoa, you see that? It's got a portrait of me on it? That's 
a little eerie. Is that the game or is that the emulator? Oh god, make it! All right, now I can go around this. Maybe that's what you're, God! Butterfeet McGee over here, god damn. Come on, baby, come on. There we go, good lord. All right, this has to be something good, right? This is the last. Damn it! Where is this stupid torch? Like, logic tells me that like, this is like a halfway point. Do you have to go to the Lost Woods first? Maybe you do. Okay, I'm gonna give it like another two or three minutes and then I'm gonna check it out. I will wait in here for the royal family's messenger. Oh! You know, do the thing of, do the thing in the name of the game. Oh, yep, that was it. Oh, if I can remember it. Okay, now if this isn't it, I truly have no idea. I told y'all my game knowledge would fall off rapidly. Okay, let's go. Ooh, I like the darkness and then we, okay, there we go. There's the torches that I was looking for for so long. All right, what's good? What the heck? Who are you? When I heard the song of, I only get that right. When I heard the song of the royal family, I expected the messenger had arrived. You're just a little kid. Has Darunia, the big boss of the Gorons, really lost so much status to be treated like this by his sworn brother, the king? Now, I'm real angry. Get out of my face, now. Are you asking why I'm in such a bad mood right now? Ancient creatures have infested the Dodongo's cavern. We have a special harvest of our special crop. Bomb flour, starvation and hunger because of this rock shortage. But this is a Goron problem. We don't need any help from strangers. I do remember we needed to go to the Lost Woods around this part of the game. Maybe this is when we need to do it? Because I think you need to play him sorry a song, right? We'll try Zelda's lullaby, but that's probably not going to do anything. It might do something. Might at least give us bomb flowers so we can warp. Oh, sweet. I'm so glad I didn't dip out. Oh, look at him. He's jamming. Oh, look at that toe tapping. Well, that's not quite what I was looking for. I wanted to hear a tune, something um from outside the mountain, something green, natural. That's the kind of music I want to hear. All right, so yeah, we do have to go to the forbidden, not the forbidden far, fortress or forest. We have to go on over to the Lost Woods. And we gotta go the long way, because we don't have any means to go ahead and bomb up those flowers yet. So, in that case, I will skedaddle do over there. I could go right here, so close. I'll skedaddle do over there, and I will meet y'all back in the Kirkiri Forest. Damn, I'm smart. I realized that I could big brain it, and then just save and quit, and go back to Kirkiri Forest. I'm real glad I thought about that, especially because I was literally just talking about the, you know, it's kind of a pain how it sets you up at the beginning of Link's house whenever you save and quit as a child. But in that case, it worked out freaking amazingly. I do not want to get that rupee. I got, I got deep pockets already, Kakiri. All right. And let's get, honestly, some of the best music. Oh, that's why that little artifact is up in the corner, because now you see it in the map but it's no longer up in the corner. Okay, so I guess it just has to be, for some reason, populated on the screen in an emulator. Or at least the music is so good. Oh, this is actually gonna help a lot since I have headphones on. I can actually hear it from coming from the right. That's so clutch. I am gonna go over here. Ooh, the Skull Kid? Play me the song of your people. You know what? I bet I have to go get Sorry a song first. Uh, we'll come back with Saria's song. Oh, and it gets louder the closer you get to it, too. And now I hear it coming out of the left. Oh my god, this is so freaking cool, dude. They're using stereo sound, who'd have thunk? Alright, three in a row. I don't know if you need to get more than three in a row. We'll slap a few more shots on there if we need to. Cool, you're great. You scored three perfect bullseyes. I have to give a neat present to such a wonderful person. Please take it. Oh, wow. Already have the, I mean, I guess your child section is pretty limited in this game, but we already have the 
biggest bag, I think. That'd be 50? We'll go ahead and, you know, maybe slap that in a few more times, see if we get anything else. Okay, that was like eight in a row. I don't think that we're gonna get anything. Doesn't look like anything. Okay, it's quieter over here. Oh, who'd have thunk that you would ever use music? Oh, hoot, hoot. Hey, over here. Hoo, hoo. Seal, good to see you again. But listen to this. Hoot, hoot. After going through the Lost Woods, you will come upon the Sacred Forest Meadow. That is the sacred place where few people have ever walked. Shoosh. What's that? I can hear a mysterious tune. You should listen for that tune too. Hoot, hoot, hoot. Do you want to hear that again? Hoot, hoot, noot. I say noot. If you are courageous, you will make it through the forest just fine. Just follow your ears and listen to the sounds coming from the forest. Hoot, hoot. Flap, 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 flap. Damn, that owl's fun. I hear it coming from the right. Oh, God. It's so cool to be able to actually use sound. I wonder, that has to be how they intended it. There's no way that's not. Forward, I think. Yeah, it's, it's getting louder. I guess, since I always played on TVs, that I never really had the chance to really be able to pinpoint the music like that. That is so freaking cool, dude. I feel like I'm gonna have to battle something here. Out! Oh god, get away, get away. Z-target him. Oh, it's a lot harder than Wind Waker since you don't have the option to parry. How many hits does this dude take? Probably one more. Ooh, that was a good guess. God, that music is good though. It looks like there's just little, little Deku guys. Oh, I can use the map. I was talking so much. Oh, them just rapid firing. I was talking so much about using the map earlier in the playthrough. I realized I really haven't been doing that much. Oh God. I also could use my shield a little bit more. I had paused it and everything, but I'm just like, nah, I don't need it. No, taking hits built character. Don't mind me. I'm just a boy in your sacred forest. Sploosh. Oh God, how do you... He goes, ah! All right, I think we're here. What? There we go. God, oh, I swear to God, if I get a game over right here, Okay, just go, just go, just go. Ooh, much, much, much too close. God, I suck at Zelda games. <laughs> That's gonna be useful at some point. Calling it. The detail on her boots is really shockingly good. It has a lot of like shadows and stuff. Good little, good little touch. This is the sacred forest meadow. It's my secret place. I feel this place will be very important for the both of us someday. That's what I feel. If you play the ocarina here, you can talk with the spirits in the forest. Would you like to play the ocarina with me? <laughs> Don't do it. Yes, I will. Okay, try to follow along with the melody I play. I am ready, Saria. Ooh, and the leaves, the green aura. Oh, it's just, I think that's one of those things that was really lost upon me when I was playing this game as a kid. Please don't forget this song. Do you promise? I promise it's in my inventory. When you play, when you want to hear my voice play Saria's song, you can talk to with me anytime. But something that I think was kind of lost upon me when I was a kid was just those little, like, Pona has the warm orange like it's the happiness of yellow combined with a little bit more of the darker earth tones of something like a like a brown since brown is basically just orange a different hue or rather orange is brown all right that beeping's gonna be real cumbersome please give me hearts i'm just gonna have to defeat these dudes but i'm so booty at combat oh come back here Please give me something. You gave me nuts. Aw, oh, nuts. Oh, I can I can do the shortcut. Cool beans. I can, oh yeah. Link's got hops for days. 
He's like uh, Zach Levine for all you basketball fans out there. Hoot hoot, you're back already. Did you learn the ocarina song from Saria? That melody seems to have some mysterious power. There may be some other mysterious songs like this that you can learn in the Hyrule. If you hold the ocarina with da 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 da, the musical staff will appear. Okay. That's... Yeah, that's super helpful to know that it's not even going to be like the like the notification noise, but I'm sure there's going to be a notification noise as well, but that the musical staff will actually pop up. That is very, very useful. But I do want to go back to that Skull Kid. And I think if I just go in the wrong place, I should be able to warp back, maybe? Because I should just be transported back to the very front. Yeah, perfect. Yeah, I want to go see what that Skull Kid has. I don't know if it's like a Simon Says game or something like that, but we'll see. Let's see if he wants us to hear Saria song. It seems like he'd do. He'd be doing a jig. Yes. You know Saria song? We should be friends. Here, take this. Oh, peace at the heart. Awesome. And we get rid of that annoying beeping, which is even better. Thanks, buddy. And what is this? Oh, this is the part where you say goodbye to Saria. I'm sure something's supposed to be here, right? Look at the Stone of Agony. There's a little dude right here. Might be able to sell us something. There we go. I surrender. To make your quest easier, I can enable you to pick up more Deku sticks. But oh uh, yeah, definitely. Why not? Especially because I think that'll just go ahead and max out our Deku sticks at 20, which is even nicer. Hell, it's worth it almost just for the refill. I doubt we'll be able to go back to Goron City this way. Yeah, there's no way in hell unless, like, you can do some, like, bomb flower trick. I'm sure you can do some bomb flower trick, but I sure as hell don't know it. Is this the entrance to Goron City? It looks... Yes, it is, but not quite right. Alrighty. So, I'ma get out of the Lost Woods. Try to, at least. Oh, that was a lot easier than I thought it would be. Alright, let's go head over to Goron City. 